Come September, there's a strength from within. There's a growing sense of want. There's a life to begin. And come September, there's a feeling in your heart. There's a comfort and a notion. This was right from the start. I was 19, I couldn't wrap my head around How anyone could ever feel a need to settle down but Hello everyone, it's Greg, American in Thailand, with you on September the 5th. What does that mean? That means it's our third anniversary of moving to Thailand and retiring. On this day, we arrived at the very quiet airport in Bangkok immediately went into our two-week COVID quarantine, which of course the world now knows that was completely unnecessary, unless you're a country that needs to lock down completely in order to steal a presidential election, then of course it works out great. But once we finished that quarantine, we did find a home builder. Seven months later, we did have this beautiful home that's standing right behind me. So we're really enjoying it. So. After three years, there is a lot of wear and tear that you get living in the tropics, living in the jungle. Um, it ranges from a lot of things. Now, first of all, there's of course, my wonderful wall that's bleeding through again on the paint that I have to retouch up. Uh, how did my bamboo project fare after the first 10 months? Well, it's gonna need some touch up paint, but it has definitely stood its ground and not fallen over one single bit. So pretty happy about that. And of course the big one, is the concrete here. Uh, typical concrete that happens in Southeast Asia, very tropical, lots of rain, lots of black mold and mildew gets all over the concrete. I could you know, wash this down with a bleach and water solution, which I'll probably try a little bit of later after the rain, rainy season dies down, which it, which it actually is right now. But uh, I am considering going to a, a stamped concrete uh, system. Found a lot of great companies found one on uh, Facebook actually, that actually responded back, back to me, uh, wind floor. And they actually gave me an actual estimate of this space I'm standing in right here, just here right in the front, 250,000 baht. There is the conversion rate for that right there. But I think I would wanna probably go all the way to the carport and wrap all the way around the house as well. Cause even the back area right here, the back uh, part of the house, looks just as bad as the front. So that'd probably be a big job, but I'm about two years away from doing this and they know that as well. They actually look forward to working with me in two years. I did locate a gentleman also on Facebook that used this company and he's had it for five years and said it still looks great and there's no cracks. So I will do a lot more research on these type of companies and see what I come up with. So that's, a big, that's the big news of there. This space right behind me has been several things. It was corn recently, but we're gonna clear this out. We're gonna build a couple of large planter boxes with some bricks, and my wife is gonna use this for her garden, growing vegetables and herbs, things like that. So that's coming up. And lastly, is there anything you can do with a neighbor's tree if you're living in Thailand? A tree that encroaches on your property constantly drops a shit ton of leaves all over your property and also these wooden type of uh, um, nut like chestnut like balls this is a rubber tree or a latex tree drops those all over the property as well at a certain time of the year is there something that can be done we actually might have a solution to that and you'd be you'd be amazed on what it is if that happens i will show it to you later that's about it for our third year wrap up here living in thailand we do have a trip planned hopefully for Switzerland next year, now that the money's coming in. What money is that? Well, that is social security money. If you saw my video about social security a little over a month ago, we finally got paid on August 31st. It was my September payment actually, but because of Labor Day and the US, I got paid on the 31st and the agent in the Philippines was correct. They did pay me from January all the way through August. So that was a nice surprise getting that deposit. So I highly recommend you file when you're 62 and not do like I did and wait till after I turn 64. But that's my advice. Do what you wanna do, just enjoy life. And we're enjoying life here in Thailand. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.
All right, take care. Bye. Now it's September, yes, and this is our day. And Lord knows this feeling, it won't ever go away. No, no, no. Cause feelings like this just won't fade. Now feelings like this just won't fade. Fade away. This is our day.